All right. Hey, I'm Elizabeth. I'm here at Stash on Trade Sneaker Boutique. I'm here with Ivory Latta, WNBA player all-star and player for the Washington Mystics. We're so excited to be here today celebrating the launch of her new shoe by Infinity, The Illist. Right behind me, as you can see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> well, Ivory, you had a great year 2013, both on and off the court. Can you tell us your favorite moment of your season in 2013? Uh, I think I have two moments. I said mm -hmm. my first moment is... Uh, putting on my shoe, mm -hmm. uh, playing in my first game, wearing the illest. And the second moment was being the all-star, first time all-star in the WNBA. So yeah. I had some great moments. You had a really <laughs> great year, and you're known very well for your energy on the court. Can you tell us how you stay so fired up? I don't know, man. I drink some Gatorade <laughs> water before the game, talk to my family. Yeah, I read you like, to your parents before Absolutely. Game, right? I, that's my ritual. I try to yeah. talk to my parents before every game. And, uh, mm -hmm. you know, they, they inspire me. They give me a lot of energy. So uh, I think it has to do with the Gatorade also and water and yeah. things like that. Yeah. And music the as well. right? <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> what kind of music do you listen to before the game? Oh, uh, you know what? What's funny? I listen to slow music to get me pumped up. Really? Yeah, I'm weird. Heard that one before. Yeah, a lot of people haven't either. No, so. but I've heard, okay, you had a lot of successes this year in 2013. Yeah. What do you think contributed the most? Uh, you know what? Just just staying prayed up. You know, yeah. believing in God and that He'll make a way for me. And you know, my my family has been a big big part of my success. So, um, you know, I'm I'm just blessed. I'm happy that all these opportunities are finally coming about. Um, through all my trials and tribulations, my ups and downs that I've had, uh, everything is finally falling in place. You finally get to celebrate. Absolutely. And your here today to help you celebrate the launch of your new shoe, right? Absolutely. They they support me in everything I yeah. do. And, you know, it's a great feeling just to see them, especially my little nieces and my nephews, just to see what I'm doing. And, you know, hopefully one day in life they can have uh, aspirations of having their own shoe or doing something big. Hey, you got to dream big, right? Yeah, you got to dream big. <laughs> That's what, like my motto is you, it's never, you're never too small to dream big. So. Right, right. And tell us why Infinity chose you to design their new basketball. Well, shoe. listen here. You see this personality? <laughs> do you see this smile? It's the winning personality. That's yeah, why, it's right? a personality. It's, it don't have anything. <laughs> do with the game. Does, no. does your personality um, reflect in the shoe? Absolutely. The it's called the illest. Uh, you know, a lot when I was playing up, growing up with a lot of guys and just playing, you're right, a lot of confidence. Playing with the guys, they always tell me I had the illest car crossover like Allen Iverson. So, you know, I always wanted to name my shoe after one of my favorite players is Allen Iverson. So I do have the illest crossover. There we go. Yeah. And um, what was your main goal in designing the shoe? You know what my main goal was? Uh, it, it was pretty much easy. I, my concept was put a lot of shoes that I wanted as a young child that I didn't get just put them all together and then create my own shoes so and uh, that's what I did so it's pretty cool concept good and how does this shoe differ from the shoes that other WNBA players wear you know what to be honest a lot of other WNBA players wear a lot of men's shoes so this shoe is mainly for women red bottoms baby red bottoms yeah <laughs> yo crazy concept though red bottoms red bottoms on the court Red bottles off the court. Whoever would have thought of that, right? Right. See, that's what I'm saying. Cool concept of them. The illness. And it helps like with our knees, our, our hips, and different things like that. So, but I, I can truly say, every since I put on a pair of these shoes, mm -hmm. my injuries have totally decreased. So that's a great thing. I love the shoe. It, it's it's a light shoe. I'm able to you know get around those big girls in the WNBA and do different <laughs> things like that. So, yeah, I mean, it's a perfect shoe. It's a perfect right. shoe. How do you see this mainly impacting female athletes? Oh, it's going to impact a lot. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I, I grew up watching you know Cheryl Swoop. She had her own shoe. Mm -hmm. Cynthia Cooper. You know, players like that who. Who, who definitely stand out. They had their own shoes, so I know with me right now having my own shoe can, you know, help a lot of girls, give them a, a sense of hope that they can do the same thing I'm doing. Right. Like I said, it's, you can never, it's never too small to dream big, and if you believe in it, it, it can happen, for sure. Right, great, and what's the next step for your future? Oh man, the next step? I have no clue, <laughs> to be honest. But That's one thing, it. it is, you know, with me, I just take one day at a time. I'm right. blessed, I'm, I'm, I'm happy that things are going the way they're going, but I can, I can definitely see this shoe in stores, uh, on women, feet, men's, everybody. I, I can definitely see big hopes and big dreams for this shoe. Great. Well, all our viewers, you can get this shoe here at Stash on Trade Sneaker Boutique. We're so excited for your Thank future, you. to follow your Thank steps, you. and we hope 2014 is even better for you than 2013. Oh, absolutely. I, I can feel it. It's going to be great. <laughs> great. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Thank you. Red bottoms on the court.